Hi everyone, it's Stefan Ivanovich here uh, with the project Go With The Flow, a global watercolour conversation. It's now Zone 7, we're up to Zone 7 and we have a fantastic group of people in Zone 7. Um, obviously this is another time zone. Um, this is the project where we're going 24 hours around the globe, 24 hours of cons constant watercolour conversation. And we're in Group 7, we have in this group La Fay, Yelena Yopton, Vikrant Sito, Emiland Mulik, and our host, Mega Kapoor. I'll leave, Hi. I'll leave it with uh, Mega. We have one little technical issue with uh, uh, two of our uh, guests still trying to get in, but we will leave that with Mega and we'll address that as we run through the program. Mega. Yes, yes, yes. Hello, everyone. Hi. Hi, I would like to introduce myself. I'm Megha Kapoor from India and I'm a watercolor artist and, and it's been great hosting this show. I, I am sure you have been watching this since morning and it's going fantastic. We have a wonderful artist here, Yelena Lokton from um, Kazakhstan Good and time. we have Malik, yeah, from India. Okay, and we have Vikran Shatole also from India and Lafay from Thailand. I, I think they have some uh, technical issue and they are able to connect, uh, they're not able to connect. But okay, we'll move on to uh, Milanji. Uh, I don't think so, he needs any kind of introduction. He is a fantastic artist. He has inspired a lot of people, a lot of youngsters, even me, you know. Uh, I, I think uh, I was the, when I started beginning my career, you know, uh, he was the one who was uh, an inspiration. He is a son of a fantastic illustrator and a painter, Mr. Pratap Malik, and he has himself been influencing so many of us. So, uh, Milanji, we would like to welcome you to this. And, Thank you. Uh, Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Hi, everyone. I have to change my glasses <laughs> change my screens. Okay. So, what do you want me to say? Maybe you ask? No, you can. Shall I show you some of my work uh, while we begin the conversation? Yes, and you can talk about your childhood, you know, how your father inspired yeah. you. So, and first I will just run beginning. through uh, the screen share of my work and meanwhile okay. I'll keep on talking. Screen share. Oh, good. So, can you see the screen? Yes. Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I mean, this is this was painted in Kerala. I've been, I've been painting for almost the last 35 years or something. But I'll tell you a little bit where uh, the watercolor bug started. Uh, my father is a painter, uh, all you know. Uh, so, he used to have these uh, British... Uh, artist magazine books when I was uh, almost in 8th or ninth standard and I saw the work of uh, one British artist called Edward Wesson. Uh, yes, Edward Wesson, he did, well yes, he's an inspiration. And uh, I, I, today also, yesterday I posted something on the Facebook, the bug which started then, it's still there. So it has been completely, uh, the influence come from the British watercolorist. Obviously, then we know about the global thing like Winslow Homer and John Singer yes. Sargent, yes. then Andrew White. So all of these have been the influences in my life. And yeah, so I'll just go further on the screen. Sure. Yeah, beautiful. Uh, okay. This was painted in Mallorca on a rooftop. Uh, this was in Shillong, if you remember Mega. We all were yes. in Shillong. And yes, people. yes. Wow. Vikran, you were And this is very much Pune. Like Pune is an old, very historical city, having some of the historical buildings which are now getting demolished day by day. So mm -hmm. I tried to capture and... Um, I mean, yeah. it's my tribute to the diminishing architecture, as wow. I see. Yeah. And this is also wow. very much Pune. These green blue colors just pop out of uh, the. I mean, if you're right, fantastic. Yeah. Traveling yes. on the street, there suddenly there is a blue and a green which pop out, which I like. Yeah. And, uh, 
Very Indian, mm. yeah. <laughs> and this is how Pune is looking right now. Because there was no cyclone warning yesterday, but it's, it's been raining heavily right now. So this is one of the rainy scapes. Wow. This is another Italy. Mm -hmm. Superb. This is our very much uh, Indian scene from Varanasi. Okay. Yes. I have, I have a book on Varanasi. I'll show you some of my books later on. Okay. Hmm. This is also a Varanasi. I call this painting... Um, the, on the Facebook, when I put my paintings, there is always a tagline along with it. So this painting was called a wormhole. So if you guys know the concept of wormhole, it's like you enter into another world. So Varanasi yes. experience was like that. Uh, though, though I'm from India and we, we all are, I mean, we Indians know about the Indian culture, but we actually haven't really mm -hmm. seen what it looks like because we live in cities like right. Pune and Mumbai. But when you go to Varanasi, yeah. the, the scenario completely flips into 360 degrees. So that's why I called it a wormhole. You get to see another mm -hmm. side of the, the story. This is again some mysterious mister is staying and <laughs> is sitting inside that temple. Wow. This is Beautiful. my very much my Pune city, which looks like a, any other metropolis. This is another little. Fabulous. Yeah, that's it. Wow. I'll just show you my. Um, see, I have so far I have written thirteen books on art instruction, hmm. out of which uh, wow. six books yeah. are on watercolor itself. <laughs> so I, I'm just sh hmm. sharing my publisher's page where all my books are. Yeah, I think it's Jyotsna Prakashan, right? Yeah. That is Jyotsna Prakashan, yeah. and uh, these are all my books. So. Many of them are on watercolor. So that's about it. Uh, besides that, if, if you want me to do a little demonstration, if, if we have time, I can do that. My yes, definitely. Definitely, we would love to see that. Yeah. Okay, you want to move further to somebody else, or I should start with them all? You could start, Milin, st if you could start, yeah, okay. and, um, and, and then we'll transition. A yeah. quick uh, gimmickry thing. It's nothing, no big deal here. Uh, uh, yeah. You be with me and uh, just uh, put the camera on. Go, Mega. Okay. okay. I think till he set up some. I'm, I'm putting uh, another camera which will uh, focus on my feet. Yeah, yeah, you, you. <laughs> yes, yes. Oh, I'm. Uh, Hello, Vikrant. I think Vikrant has already joined us. So, uh, welcome. Welcome, Vikrant. We were really... <laughs> yes, yes. Hello, everyone. Yes, so we have Vikrant uh, Chitole from India. He's also a very well-known watercolorist here. And uh, he has been working uh, from some last so many years. Uh, we know him. He is also uh, the... A brand ambassador of White Knights is with me, yeah, and he has uh, worked uh, for so many projects in Europe as well. I think, uh, okay, introduce yourself, Vikrant, and uh, we would like to see some of your works. Thank you, Vikrant. Uh, thank you, Vikrant, for uh, uh, this honor. I'm really honored to be part of this really innovative uh, event online event. It's not an easy <coughs> event uh, to gather so many amazing artists at a time at, under mm -hmm. one roof. So uh, congratulations and very big thanks for you. And uh, <coughs> I think Megan the cyclone already, is affecting, yeah? Yes, I cyclone think cyclone, is very, yeah. Yeah, cyclone has affected electricity and internet in our area. So today also I am facing internet issue. Uh, right now I am using my mobile data. Let's see how it goes. Hopefully it should be fine. So uh, uh, thank you for uh, starting the session. Is the one of the most inspiring uh, 
all of us have started our journey from Vilisa's book, I think. So thanks to him also. Uh, so basically, I'm a fine art uh, graduate. Uh, like uh, from my childhood, I was always keen, keen about drawing it in pain, it because, because I still remember when I, I wasn't able to even talk. Before that, I started, uh, you know, doodling on walls or on ground. So somehow, you know, it came from, it came naturally in, in me because uh, if you ask me ki, who inspired you to become an artist, so I would say ki, I don't think ki, I, ha I have, you know, seen anyone uh, drawing and I, I got inspired. So it's, it is not like that. So mainly I got inspired from uh, nature only because whenever I see any object or any scenario or anything, so, you know, each object or each, each subject, it, you know, communicates with me and uh, it inspires me to, you know, interpret that story in my medium. Like, uh, mm -hmm. usually I work in all mediums. Uh, oil is also one of my favorite medium, but uh, water has been always, you know, because I like the flow of water. Watercolor is uh, like magic because I have been always into all this fluid medium, not only water, but fluid medium. Because uh, this fluid medium, it performs itself. It gives you so many interesting and uh, accidental effect. It, it works with you. So, Do you uh, have a few of your works? Uh, yeah. Yes. Can you? So, I would like to show some of my uh, favorite subjects, favorite paintings. So here you go. So recently, uh, in this lockdown period, I tried to keep myself busy with some of these paintings. So this is one of the paintings which I did in lockdown. This uh, this painting I have done on a Magnani hot press paper. Actually, actually, this paper was very smooth and very very difficult to handle watercolor on this paper. But I really enjoyed this. So this is a cat. Uh, this is one more. Uh, my favorite painting, which I did a few years back. Wow. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, yes. Beautiful. Another one from my little series. Oh. Wow. <laughs> I hope you can see clearly my screen. Perfect. Yes, 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 it's clear. Oh. Yes. So this one is one of my simplified landscape because uh, <laughs> You, you will see some of my work, you can see a lot of different uh, style approaches in my uh, landscape. This is wide variety, yes. Yeah, yes. little bit variety. Because I keep trying uh, experimenting different uh, approach or, I don't know, I like to experiment with a different form. Currently I have, uh, this is my latest work, you can see. Mm -hmm. This is again a plain air work and I am uh, right now working more into my making it simplified and I am trying to create my own form. Like as you can see, all these houses are distorted. Yes. You know, I am I'm, uh, simplifying the shapes and I am, you know, more distorting them. More stylization. More, yeah, yeah, more of stylization. Yeah. Yes. yes. So this is not a studio work, it's a plain air work. Okay. This is again a plain air work. So mm -hmm. this is one amazing place called Bundi in Rajasthan. I think all artists must visit this place. So Beautiful. amazing place to paint. You will love it. Uh, this is a realistic approach. Uh, this was a demo in one. This is again from Rajasthan. Uh, this is one of my uh, daily painting series uh, because once in a year I try to uh, I, I I choose one month and I do every day one painting from life. So these are all parts of that series. Very nice. So you know when sometimes it is difficult to find subjects. You know, 
So I try to uh, communicate with each and every object, and I try to make them my own subject. Mm -hmm. This is our kitchen area. <laughs> Very nice, yeah. beautiful. Yeah. This is again a keychain. Keychain uh, set. These are my kids' toys. Very interesting. <laughs> <subject. laughs> yeah, more like your daily journal. It's it's it looks like more like your daily journal, you know. Maintain yeah. maintaining yeah. Yes, you can say that. Uh, again this is my bike. I love my bike. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's great. That's great. Yeah. <coughs> you know, sometimes most of the artists they only uh, find to maintain only beautiful sceneries or beautiful characters. But sometimes I feel that you should be able to find beauty in each object. So two years back, I did one exhibition also. It was called Commonly Uncommon. So I exhibited all these works. Mm -hmm. I would like to hear from you. If you yeah, can. no, they're they're fantastic. They are wonderful. There's a there's a definite sense of lockdown in all those paintings. So yeah. you've obviously been at uh, been busy <clears throat> at home. With the family, and you've had you've found inspiration in the com, you know objects around the home. So that's fabulous. Right. Yes. This is again one uh, monochromatic painting which I did in my recent workshop, online workshop, while not done. Wow. This is the old temple from Kumbhi. This is a this is one experimental work which I. Mm -hmm. More like yeah. <clears throat> so this is one of my favorite painting, and this painting has already awarded one big award a few years back. So I would like uh, I like space. If you can see in this painting, you can see a lot of white space. So I yes. like uh, uh, space in my painting. So I try to capture uh, space in my paintings. This is again yeah. my favorite wow. subject, bike. wow. bikes. Bikes. <laughs> <laughs> I think we can't see Milinji painting here. Yeah? Can we? No. Yeah. Did he? Did Did Milin stop? Stop. Yes. Yeah. I'll share screen from another. Uh, okay. Shall I continue, or we should wait for Sir's? Uh, no, no. Continue. You continue. Continue. Continue, continue Vigan. Maybe this is give me a share screen option. Um, share screen to um, million. Oh, there it is. Yeah, we can, we can. No, yeah. We've got, that's Vikrant at the moment. So these are from my latest uh, visit yeah. to Nepal. Mm -hmm. Wonderful, beautiful. See, the, the spots are very similar, right? Approach is different. You can see this painting yes. and this painting. Yes. I tried to experiment with two different styles here. A lot of movement, yes. Yes. Okay. This was a big Shilong uh, event. Okay. Yeah, okay. okay. Finish, you give me a share screen. Okay. Yeah. So. Vikram, these these paintings are fabulous. Um, I think we've sort of got to we we need to to move on. We'll um we'll share back with uh, Million for for a bit, and then we'll continue uh, with. We should we we started with Mi Million. Sorry, Mega. What's happening with uh, million your your share screen function? There we go. There you go. That's it. It's yeah, working. Yeah, it's Beautiful. 
We can see you. Yeah. Yeah. No, but it's another screen that you can share. Anyway, uh, please then you can see it. One, one second. So you've just started. Yeah. Fabulous. Start. Um, the share. Um, we're having some difficulty with the share screen. Mil uh, million. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's better. Now it's okay. Here we go. There you go. That's better. Yep, now we're yes. on. You're away. Yeah. So, will you talk us through it? To us, talk us through what you're doing. Yeah, I, I'll talk through it. See, this is a this is more like a. I'm I'm a brand ambassador for Daniel Smith Paint, Bristol Paper, mm -hmm. and uh, his collaborations. But mm -hmm. people in Pune say that I'm a brand ambassador for this vehicle called as rickshaw because I paint it very often. <laughs> okay, so I'm not showing you. Riksha in this. So let's see how it goes about it. So Pune is a town where uh, there were a lot of uh, bicycles earlier. Now, of course, the cars are taking over. But uh, during the bicycle time and even today, there are a lot of these automobile vehicles which are three dealer. Maybe, Stefan, you uh, haven't seen this. These are only in India and Thailand. These are all new for me. <laughs> But it's interesting to watch you work with your board, <coughs> so vertical. <laughs> yeah. So that's why I'm just... Uh... I'm Fast my... sketch. Yeah. So is th this, this is practice for you, this painting this same the same vehicle all the time? <laughs> yeah, it's it, more than a practice. Like, yeah. <laughs> it, your signature? <laughs> yeah, it's kind of signature. Mm. That's... <clears throat> wow. I mean, a anybody can recognize it's his. <laughs> yeah. He's probably standing there with his eyes shut. <laughs> I mean, this is a just a perfect example of um, you know when you're loading a lot of uh, uh, thick paint and thin paint. Some holds, some runs, you know, and um, it's really just controlling that, isn't it? It's great, fantastic. So do you have any, do you have any, um, uh, uh, you're painting this, do you have any uh, competitions or, or uh, competitions, exhibitions coming up in the future? I mean, obviously with uh, yeah, them yeah, at the moment. In Pune once a year. Yeah. So um, many a time the exhibition is based on some kind of themes. Like yeah. Because I was in Varanasi, so that's mm -hmm. Varanasi. Sometimes the city skip, whenever I have a trip to Europe, then you know. So right now nobody knows how long the lockdown the whole thing is going. But True. usually I paint in August time, most of the time. Have you painted something special during this lockdown? Have you I mean something uh, which is not not really special, I will show you will share some of my things. Because I've been taking this online classes. So mm -hmm. okay. Unfortunately, my studio, this is my house, like my studio is in a different place, which I am not visiting very ah, uh -huh, uh -huh. long time. Um, so I am not painting my very big stuff, but since I am taking the online classes, I am more into um, the classwork, which I will share a little bit. I see. <clears throat> it's, it's coming together, it's coming together. Yes. Oh. Yes, it's already came out. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, 
actually as million as as you're painting this um maybe what we'll do um uh omega maybe we as million is painting this we can, um we can move and have a yes. chat with uh, yelena chat and with Milena, and and, yes. and, Yel and million keep painting yeah. keep painting and uh, we'll come back to yeah. you no, 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 no. this is just a uh, uh, kind of that's a taster. Uh, I'll, I'll just share one or two paintings yeah, which yeah. I've done during the lockdown mm. and then you can do it with Elena. Yeah, is it okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, just, yes, yes. Just, it's my turn. Just, uh, not, not yet. We're just going to have just one more minute with two minutes, two minutes with Milind yes, yes. and then go, go Milind. So put him on. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yep. Go. Yes. No, the, this, this is from the uh, workshop yesterday, so it's no big deal, mm. but a little nice picture in the thing. Mm. Yeah, the same thing again from the workshop yesterday. Yes, okay. Beautiful. What's, what are the what are the you can move to the, what are the boards? What are the papers you're painting on, Milind? What are the papers that you normally use? The one that you had that was a uh, thicker board is that a is that I, on? I painted on the Indian handmade paper. But ah. Normally, I use arches, um, waterboard, mm -hmm. and rooster. Oh, waterboard, waterboard. Okay, yeah, got waterboard it. Too. Okay, got it. So, yeah. Mega. I, I tried and uh, experimented on different papers. So mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. So whichever paper comes in my way, uh, behave differently, which gives me a kind of creative uh, mm, induction, you can say. So the discomfort zones, so I like to explore the discomfort zone many a time. That turns out to be more uh, creatively challenging. Yeah. That's what I do. You can do Right. It. Yeah. Fabulous. Fabulous. Okay. Yes. So now we have with us Yelena Lokton from uh, Kazakhstan. Hi, Elina. Hi. And Hi. How are you doing during this uh, time? And, uh, yeah. yeah, yeah. You have a fantastic studio. But yeah. My surname... Yes, yes. My surname, not Lokton. E. Okton. E. Okton. E. Okton. Yes. E. Okay, okay, okay. Yes, yeah. yes. Okay, thank you for inviting me to uh, this global conversation. And, uh, but... I'm now very nervous because <laughs> Relax. I spell uh, English and um, it's so exciting to see my old and new friends. Uh, Vikram, uh, we met uh, with him in Spain many uh, years ago, maybe three or four. Yes. And um, uh, fantastic uh, watercolorist and uh, love my friends. I. Uh, visit with him Fabriana a few times and uh, uh, Albania, Vietnam and uh, of course you Mega, I know you and uh, nice to see you all and meeting with, uh, pardon, sorry, uh, okay. meeting with uh, Stefan of course. Uh, little um, stories about my education. Uh, my um, childhood, I uh, always uh, liked painting, and my um, I graduated from art school, and after later I um, 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 from uh, art and graphic uh, department of the um, state uh, art state university, and a few years ago I uh, repeat. Uh, my uh, watercolor because I'm uh, I very like this technique because it's um, like um, magic, you know, uh, very interesting technique. And uh, I was uh, getting inspiration from many uh, fantastic watercolorists like uh, Alvaro Castaniet, Thomas Scheller, uh, Louis. Um, <laughs> Ilya Ibrayev, uh, Sergei yeah. Kurbatov, and uh, Joe Dolden, Miguel Linares, uh, and uh, many other paintings. Um, I still haven't decided um, what my uh, favorite subjects uh, yet. So you have a, a painting of white? Sorry, sorry. sorry. 
Sorry, yes, because I like uh, paint, uh, portraits and uh, landscapes and uh, if uh, I can uh, show you, uh, for example, yes, yes. <laughs> yes. this is my uh, new paintings, yes, I oh. like um, in Kazakhstan, very interesting local people and uh, very interesting local na na the national uh, costumes. Wow. And wow. this, um, this um, celebrating now Rus, now Rus, and I want to, um, this woman preparing uh, that. Wow. Yes, wow. Yes, yes. And uh, I want to show so softly easy this material. Mm. Um, mm. Yes. Yes. That's gorgeous. Oh. Yes. yes. Wow. More than and soft. Uh, uh, yes. <laughs> I like yes. this. Uh, this sister, very funny and happy. Wow. Yes. You see? Yes. Beautiful. You see? Yes. Yes. Beautiful. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, our um, uh, wow. how to say yeah. in in also market. Also a local. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yes. Yes. Yeah, yeah. A local yeah. woman. Local woman. Yes. It's, uh, her name Tamara. Um, At the market. Wow. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Fabulous. Oh. Wow. This picture um, uh, from um, exhibition in Romania. Mm -hmm. uh, wow. I uh, take one first place yes. with prize. Yes, yes, in Romania. Wow. Fantastic. Wow. Yeah. I think uh, all uh, artists know this place. Uh, it's <laughs> Fabrian. Fabrian. Yeah, we can. <laughs> you can. Uh, yes. Know uh, yeah. Nicholas Lopez. Nicholas, Nicholas Lopez. Lopez. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he's Nicholas. Yeah. Was was very funny in this um, yes. place. Yes. <laughs> when I start. Uh, mm. So my. My tak. You see, in yes. my, my studio, yes, yes. it's very yes. comfortable uh, table because uh, table very big, like uh, seal window. Yes, right, mm -hmm. right. And uh, very comfortable um, painting because uh, very mm, bright light. Yes, yes, mm -hmm. yes. That's a great space. That is a beautiful space. I love the light. The light is beautiful. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, I have uh, hand make, of course, light. <coughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This. But uh, I don't like uh, painting. I don't like painting. Pardon? Sorry. Yeah. Uh, okay. it's, it's the night. I like uh, natural light. Yes, yes. Light. Yes. And then um, in Almaty, uh, all watercolorists from um, Kazakhstan, we uh, preparing um, uh, painting with uh, from because we uh, we want to. Oh, my English. Sorry. It's very <laughs> good. To, it's very good. Have exhibition yes in the museum but uh, quarantine you know we stay at home of oh, course yes now yes i like um uh, just just a moment this uh you know yes yes that's good that's good this uh Yes, it's not uh, comfortable to show because reflection. Yeah. Yes, yes, yeah. reflection. And now you saw. You sh yes, yes, we can see it. Yes, yeah. yes. It's very interesting uh, girl uh, costumes, uh, nationality costumes. Yes, Kazakh uh, girl. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, fabulous. Yes. 
Were you born in this place? Why are you from uh, Kazakhstan only? Yeah. Sorry, repeat please. Are you born here or are you are from, I mean, is this your... Uh, Birthplace? Yeah. Were you, were you born? Okay. Were you born, were, were you born here? Are you... Are you uh, were you born you? in Kazakhstan? Yes. 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 This woman from Kazakhstan, of course, a Kazakh lady, um, preparing uh, some wools. Mm -hmm. Wow. wow. Mm -hmm. Yes. And uh, for me, uh, I like monochrome painting. Uh, you know, um, for example, this old picture, this... Uh, yes. um, it's man homeless from England, yes, but it's small, small size. And yeah. I, uh, Dwarf. I repeat this till, but big size and monochrome. Uh, monochrome, yes. I think, uh, more tra tragical. I don't know how to say tragic. Tragic, yes. tragic. Yeah. Dramatical, yes, Dramatic. yes, homeless. Uh -huh. Uh, it's my favorite painting. Mm. I like it. Wow, that's that's a beauty. beautiful. It's beautiful. Wow. Wow, that's great. That's fabulous. <laughs> yes, and uh, monochrome as a painting, Kazakh lady with horse. So you love your culture, yeah. <laughs> Well, yes, it's uh, uh, because I live. I was born in Kazakhstan. I live uh, in here, but it's uh, but I'm Russian woman. Uh, but uh, I like um, um, Kazakh uh, culture. Mm. I like it. When I stay, um, uh, how to say? Oh my God! Sorry. No, you're good. <laughs> Relax, relax. That's good. <laughs> um, I, uh, when I stay in quarantine, um, as all big, uh, all uh, people uh, make me appreciate even more the beauty of my country, my city. Mm -hmm. We have uh, the nature in Kazakhstan. Uh, magnificent and uh, diverse and uh, almost from everywhere in Almaty our um, one could see a mountain uh, covered uh, in snow and uh, I when I stay yeah. in, at home in quarantine I made many many sketches yes. wow yes. Our, our mountain Yes. I think you should invite all of us to your country. Yes. Ah. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yelena, we are coming over to visit you. Yes. Welcome, welcome. We're going to paint those mountains. Yeah, I will help you. I will help you. <laughs> <laughs> this is uh, from maybe, this view may be from uh, 40 minutes from my home. Wow. My wow. Okay. Very, very uh, close. Yes, yes. Wow. You, you have been busy in lockdown. Super. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Fabulous. Look at that. This lake, uh, lake, uh, mm, big lake, uh, big Almatins, well, big. <laughs> Sorry. Big lake. Yes. Just superb. Wow. I like um, use technique, different technique. Uh, always um, experimenting. Say, mix. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Um, <clears throat> wet and dr uh, draw. And spray. Okay. You see spray. You spray. And, uh, Yes, yes. Uh, for, uh, yes, yes. Uh, what uh, uh, material? No questions, no questions. <laughs> because I don't ask you. Which uh, yes, material? This paper and color you have used for this uh, this painting, which you showed showed to me right now. 
Yes. Is this short? Yeah. What paper you are using? And ah. what paper and what colors? Yes, my favorite, my favorite uh, paper, of course, Ash. My uh, Ash, 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 Ash paper. Yes. Oh. Yes. Uh -huh, uh -huh. But for, uh, for these sketches, um, Saunders, maybe uh, Fabrian, I like. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. And others? How did. Uh, and uh, um, was... we have very interesting steps. Mm -hmm. uh, welcome to Kazakhstan. Very interesting place. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> yes. Ye Yelena, one question. What is wow. what is your it's palette like? What is your paint palette? What does that look like? What colors do you have in your palette? <laughs> is that is that uh, is that a secret? <laughs> palette. My uh, brand of uh, Oh, what what colors? Yeah, show your palette what it looks like. Ah, that's yes, yes. Big, huh? <laughs> uh, I like, of course, Daniel Smith. Sure. My favorite brushes, my favorite brushes, uh, Chinese, uh, Chinese. Mm -hmm. I don't know how to brand. I don't that's know. okay. That's okay. Uh, of, Chinese, course, uh, Korea, of course, Korean heron. Wow, wow. Korean, yep, yep. Uh, my favorite, of course, interesting um, heron. Wait, mm -hmm. sorry. Uh -huh, uh -huh. It's good. I like the good brushes. Fabulous. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Yes. And uh, 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 my sorry, pardon. My um, colors. Oh, pardon. Sorry. That's okay. Um, Majority, of course, um, Daniel Smith. Yes. Fabulous. Wow. Great. Sorry, just just minutes. You've done a fabulous job. You've done a fabulous job. Wow. <laughs> Go mega. I think I in uh, yeah. instead in Kazakhstan uh, we can um, meet. Um, camel. Yes. Camel. Yes, 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 yes. It's normal for us. <laughs> Good, but mm. not of uh, city center, of course. Yeah, I think let's move to Milanji. Yeah. And let's see what he has painted. Yeah. Absolutely. We have um, yeah. we have two minutes to go. So please, yep. yeah. So, Milind, go Milind. Yes, go Milind. Two minutes. Yeah. Oh, no, I, I didn't paint it. I mean, I just finished it. Oh, okay. That was a quick, quick demo. That was a quick yeah. Well, can I ask one question of all of you, um, which I have been asking before? But, um, you know, they ha we are in difficult times or have been in difficult times. Has has this time really uh, made you focus on your, your um, art in a different way? Or has it uh, promoted a different type of creativity? Or, have, or is it a combination of all of those things? And obviously you're with your families. So what has been most important for you during these times? Can I answer first? Sure. Yeah, okay. sure. See, uh, see, I saw the on the Facebook. Like, uh, actually the lockdown has made no difference to me, so I keep on wondering, am I a kind of anti-social person? Uh, but <laughs> I go to my studio, I, go to, I meet people. But uh, the lockdown in that sense, in psychological sense, has not made any difference. So maybe I'm uh, kind of anti-social person. But I'm definitely uh, missing the comfort of my studio. Because my mm. com studio, everything is set up. Like, I don't have to... Move my brushes and keep them back in the yeah. sink and go and uh, clean the sink etc mm -hmm. which i have to do it at home yeah so that comfort has definitely lost but uh, since uh, as i told earlier also um, for the creativity uh, i believe there is an uncomfort discomfort zone is very essential for being creative yeah. Yeah. you're in the comfort zone you can get into some kind of habitual things Mm -hmm. During the lockdown, I've been taking online workshops, I've been doing what, 
But uh, besides that, I've been experimenting a lot with my iPad and Procreate. The ideas which were there for the last 10 or 15 years, which I couldn't really mm. explore. Okay, the ideas right. were there. And when I go back to my studio, I go back to my comfort zone, I go back okay. to my norm, I mean, the studio life. So I'm going to say okay. it again, again. So this lockdown yes. has been okay. to explore my uh, creative ideas, Great. which I wouldn't have been easily done otherwise great thanks yes, thanks yes. Milan. We, we have been watching your uh, procreate series and it's fantastic i mean uh, yeah, so maybe it maybe it will translate into watercolor maybe it great. will translate back maybe okay. not yeah. okay. yeah. vikrant last word from you last word yes. from you yeah 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 i would like yeah. to share that uh, I, I i agree with the Melissa that this lockdown has actually not made any difference because uh, most of us are off because most of the artists, they like to, you know, they uh, work alone, actually. They need, uh, you can say, isolation. Okay. So, it is not making any much difference, but only one thing is we are missing the plein air painting. Mm -hmm. Because if I don't go out, so, you know, sometimes you require that kind of inspiration. You yeah. Know, go out and communicate with. Uh, different places to okay. get the energy great okay so that thing i missed and secondly uh one thing i benefited about uh like if i had no time with me so uh most of the artists so we are not organized so mm -hmm. i had this time so i i look at my paintings you know around so i uh, but let's organize all the paintings all together. Okay. I, I, uh, Vikant, we're going uh, to have to we're going to have to call it a uh, call the line. Thank you. Only because we're running on to on schedule. Can I thank everyone? Can I thank everyone here uh, for you. your thank time you. and your you. energy and commitment to coming to share your gallery, uh, your studios, your work, your thoughts, your paintings with us all, not only here in the studio, but all, also to the people that are watching you all around the globe. Uh, I'm sure they have had an amazing time listening to your, your stories and to your thoughts and to your painting processes. And again, can I thank uh, Yelena, Vikrant, Milind and Mega. Thank you all. Unfortunately, thank La, you. La, unfortunately, thank La, La Faye couldn't make thank it you, to thank us you so much. today. Yes. Thank you once again. Thank you. Thank you. And remember, thank you. as we've been saying all along here, thanks for coming along and uh, go with the flow. <laughs> go with the flow. Thank you.